You know, if you love cats, it can really be crushing when you can't have one because you or a loved one is allergic to them. Now, a California biotech company, Alerca, says it has a new breed of cats specifically bred to not trigger your allergies. And veterinarian Dr. Bernadine Cruz is a spokeswoman for Al Alerca, and she also has Joshua, a very scared 18-month-old kitten who, yeah, but he's going to get used to us, I hope. Yeah. Who you say, Dr. Cruz, good morning to good you. Good morning. Welcome. You say that Joshua is hypoallergenic. Right. So if you have severe, severe allergies, you'll probably still react to Joshua or Joshua's siblings or his, his relatives. But 99% of the people, like a lot who's been here holding the cat hasn't had the itchy eyes hasn't had the runny nose the itchy throat because I'm allergic to cats myself and I've been playing with Joshua and he doesn't cause me any problems and that it really could be good news for those who love cats but are allergic to them now talk a little bit about the process because we're not talking about cloning he's not cloned no. to get Joshua and other kitties like Joshua how do you come up with this hypoallergenic cat it was this very specialized test that Alerka came up with that's finding a very minute change in the the gene that makes a certain protein that's in the kitty's saliva, the urine actually comes out of their skin. So even if you had a furless cat, you could still be allergic to them. So they've been able to develop this test, then come up with a way of finding kitties such as this little honey, who now is breeding and making siblings who people are not allergic to. This is it's so amazing. Now, of course, there are a number of allergens that cats carry that yeah. can cause allergies, and you have selectively bred, if you will, for the one that's the most common. Right. Very high tech process, which means that the cats cost a lot. They can cost up to six, seven thousand dollars. Well, in actual, it's a little under four thousand dollars is what Joshua is going to be going for, and Joshua's siblings. And some people think, oh my goodness, that is a tremendous amount of money. But if you have a severe allergies yourself, all those things that you go through trying to use the HEPA filters and having your rugs removed, etc. And if you've ever wanted a cat, how do you put a price tag on having such a sweet little honey like this that you've always wanted or somebody in the family is allergic to, you've never been able to have, now you have this unconditional love. Well, I don't know if Joshua was given unconditional love today, but I understand your point. Now, if someone wants one of these cats, right. what's the process that they have to go through in order to get one? You can go to alerca.com, learn all about how you can order it. And if you are somebody who's allergic and wants a kitty, a month before you are going to be given the cat, they will send you a special allergy test to find out your degree of allergic response. And if you're too severe, they're going to recommend that you do not get a cat because their number one priority for these kitties is the health and well-being of these cats. All right. Well, it could really mean good news. Of course, we've been talking to uh, Ilana, uh, Ilana all morning long, and we're going to have her step right back in. You've been severely allergic, Ilana, and you yes. held this cat all morning long. I'm Any reaction? Fine. I'm fine. No difference. Are you surprised? Have you ever met a cat that you didn't react to? Oh, I'm shocked. I react to every cat. I cannot date someone who has a cat. Well. So... This is amazing. There you go. You might want to put Ilana on your payroll. <laughs> She's a great testimony. Dr. Bernadine Cruz, thank you so much, Ilana. Thanks for playing along. Still ahead, we showcase Bob Barker celebrating.